Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. And so we stand for the anthems. does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. So it's down to business here. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Oh, he's had a goal! Goal! What a start, and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Was there ever any doubt? That's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do, concentrate on what you have to do. Alava take the early advantage. Plays it over to the other flank. Chalhanolu. Tufan. A real chance to break. Oh, that is asking for trouble. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can run your way through a defence like that? It's, it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Alava can have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Massive leap! Again, let me mention what a wonderful stop the goalkeeper pulled off there. Really wonderful. Under. Gets the better of his man. 
He's got options in the box if he gets it up to meet it. Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He gets past his goes for goal! Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. He's pulled off a fine save. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. Towering header! Harmlessly behind. Alava have it back and they can go again. In comes the cross. And the finish! Decent enough try. Oh, did give it a fair old crack and he'll be encouraged to step up again. And there, going through, ball's gone out of play, he's got it on the right now, what's on, looks to set one up, in for a header, oh, just couldn't turn it in, well he certainly got to the ball well enough but the rest didn't quite come off for him. Hook brings the ball forward. He's got away. Hulk. Hulk! Yes! And they are cruising away. That really is quite fabulous. All his own doing. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly. And they don't know how to stop him. goes for half time. Well, there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes, but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull. One sided, yes, but packed with excitement. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Alava, very much in control here. Three up and cruising. 
just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Soyuncu. Soyuncu plays it forward. Thiago Silva. And here's Hulk. Neymar going for goal! Oh, that is rather wayward. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Across the field it goes. Chelhanolu. Gets it back. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Well, he helps himself to a treble, Peter, and then they switch on. It's a bit late now. It's Roberto Carlos! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. And it's Yilmaz. Yokushlu. Hoists it forward. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Under. Burek Yilmaz. Forward. What does he try from here? Oh, real danger here! Ball's loose, who's getting there? He's left it, Rivaldo! Adriano! Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Driving on. It's Neymar! That is a class save. He had to be at his best. Yeah, they got away with it, but that was a, a defensive letdown to see him march through like that. Heaves it forward. And it's Neymar. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Luis battles to win it back. Hulk. Dashing forward at pace. And he's on his way! Has a goal! Sticks it away! Surely now they are well and truly out of sight. And that really is so, so impressive. Rivaldo showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him.
Turkey have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been... Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Alava, yeah. irresistible here. Dominant, utterly ruthless. Only ever one result. A comfortable win. Your reflections then, Jim. Yeah, we knew there was a sizeable gap in the quality of both squads and, and the story was told in predictable fashion.